Hello, I'm Roger. I'm the author of this book right here, The Resolute Self Mind Control Manual. And I'm going to teach you how to control your mind right now. You can read this book for free. Just go to YouTube and type in Resolute Self in the search bar and it should come right up. It's a video of me going through the book page by page. So you would have to use pause to read the page and then unpause it and then read the next page and so on and so forth. But I've made it completely free for you. You don't have to buy anything. And uh, if that's not enough, I'm going to talk you through the method right now. First of all, let me say that um, I would venture to say, if I had to guess, that your mind has been like the wild west with those thoughts for a long time, hasn't it? Thoughts that you don't really want to think, but you can't help yourself. They just seem to kind of hijack your mind. And um, I'm going to show you how to get rid of all those thoughts. Okay. You don't have to be afraid of these thoughts. These thoughts have no power, no matter what they tell you. They might tell you that um, if you stop thinking the them, if you stop thinking about them, that something terrible is going to happen to you, or um, these thoughts will tell you that something terrible will happen to your family. Don't be afraid of that. Don't be afraid of these thoughts. These thoughts are absolutely powerless, but they are looking to become reality in your life. So you do need to get rid of them. And I'm going to show you how to get rid of these thoughts for good. Okay. This method is described in this book right here. And, um, it's described in detail. And, uh, in this version, which is the one that's on YouTube, I have put, um, the entire deluxe edition, so you get a lot of really good information. Okay, so basically what you're going to do is imagine in your mind, this might sound a little bit strange to you, but don't worry about it. Um, once you get it down and start using it, and using it consistently, you're going to get rid of these thoughts, and they're, gonna, they're not going to come back in your head. They're going to be afraid to come back in your head because... They know that they will be killed if they come back into your head because you're going to become the angel of death to these thoughts that you want to get rid of. And I'm going to tell you how to do that right now. On the left hand side of your head, imagine that there's like a great big truck, like a big white truck and, um, that you could just put things right in the top of. Okay. And also there's a line of trucks. When that one drives away, ready to replace it. Hundreds and hundreds of these trucks right on the left side of your head. Now imagine that you have perhaps a hundred. Um, these are all in your head now. A hundred of these um, workers. They, uh, they would look like military workers. Like some type of uh, special ops workers. And they're all... Every single one of them is a badass. And they all work for you 24 hours a day. So anytime a thought comes into your head that you do not want there and you do not want coming back, you imagine these, these uh, security people in your head grabbing that thought, forcefully grabbing it, putting it into this truck that's right on the left-hand side of your head. And there's no chance that the thought can get out of the truck. It's secured in there. Now, the, now imagine the truck being driven a mile down the road away from you. In a mile down the road, there is this huge, huge hole in the earth. And this hole goes all the way down to the very core of the earth. And this area is so hot that it will never, it literally will never and can never cool off. And anything that's put into this hole is vaporized. It's absolutely vaporized. 
So anytime you get one of these thoughts, the thought is seized, the thought is put into the truck, the truck is driven a mile down the road to the hole, and the thought is dumped into this hole to be vaporized. So I, one thing that I want to tell you is that it is completely and perfectly okay to spend more time getting rid of thoughts than it is actually thinking. As a matter of fact, that's the way it's going to be for you at first, but you just got to be consistent. And I can promise you that if you're consistent with this, that it really does work. I promise to God, and I give you my word as a gentleman, that since 2019, I'm coming on my fingers, um, five years, I have not had any unwanted thoughts in my head. When I put here on the cover of this book, all disturbing thoughts will be absolutely terrified of you and stay far away. I mean that. I meant that. This is what this method really and truly does. And I know that what I've just described to you might almost seem childish. But this is the way out. This is what really works. And you know, you might say something like, uh, Oh, well, okay, why didn't you just put a black hole on the side of your head and have the thoughts go in there? Because that's not the way that it works. And there's a, there's a very good reason why I have done everything that I have um, done the way I've done it with this method. And I really hope that you will give it a try. Every single time, and I don't care how scary the thought is, I don't, it, the scarier the thought, the more you should treat the thought with the wrath that it deserves. And I promise you, there are no repercussions for standing up to your thoughts. Let me say that to you again. I promise you, I promise you, there are no repercussions for standing up to your thoughts and reclaiming your mind. And this is the way to reclaim your mind. So anytime a thought comes into your head, the thought is seized. The thought is put into the truck. The truck is driven down the road a mile. And the thought is dumped into this inferno of a hole. And the thought is vaporized as soon as it's put into the, into the hole. So you're, you might be thinking to yourself, okay, well, what if I get rid of the thought and vaporize the thought? And then the thought comes right back in my head. You do the same thing. You keep putting it in the truck and you keep put, you keep driving it to its death. You keep putting the thought into the truck and you keep driving the truck to its death over and over and over again. When I first started, when I first invented this method, I would follow that truck with my mind all the way to the, to the giant burning hole in the earth. And I would watch the thought get dumped into it. I would visualize this in my head. This is all you're visualizing this. And I can promise you that those thoughts are going to get tired of being destroyed by you. And I can promise you that these terrible, terrible, disturbing thoughts, these annoying thoughts, these nattering thoughts, these thoughts that have made you walk around your whole life going like this, being afraid of them, you're not going to be afraid anymore. I promise you, if you'll just use this method and do it over and over again. And I want you to go on YouTube and I want you to look the book up and I want you to read the book, read the entire book to put what I have just told you into context. And, um, if this doesn't sound like something you want to do, then, well, why mess with a good thing? You could just keep on going the way you've been your whole life. So I hope you'll take this into consideration. Thank you. Bye-bye.